Peace and greetings. Uh, I don't know if this vlog will come out uh, good or not, but I'm going to my first concert while living in my van. Um, so this should be interesting. Gonna go see this band, uh, Melvin and JGB, and have a good time. So it goes good. <laughs> Picking up a few friends. I think there should be like four people total in my van. Uh, by the end of tonight, so... So I just got back from the show. It was pretty amazing. Uh, it is 3.30 in the morning, so I'm pretty tired. And I'm about to jump into that seven inch memory foam bed and fall asleep. I know it probably looks like I am completely smashed, and that's because that is the truth. <laughs> but it was pretty awesome and had a great night. And you know, you can still have an amazingly awesome night while living in your van or in a vehicle, RV or whatever. I will go into more detail tomorrow, but tonight, good night, peace. Peace and greetings. Uh, I wanted to give a recap for the last two days at the show that I went. So it was pretty fun. Um, it was really the first shows I've been out to since living in my van. And I went to see uh, JGB with Melvin. Super dope. It's like a Grateful Dead band. Um, huge turnout. It was crazy, super crazy turnout. So many people. Bumped into a lot of friends and stuff. And... Uh, yeah, it was definitely uh, <laughs> intense. It was just like a huge like family reunion uh, at these two shows. So yeah, I definitely enjoyed myself, had fun. And I went with my best friend on the first night. She actually bought me tickets for the shows. The second night, she wasn't feeling good and had to, uh, um, had to do some other really cool stuff with um, a good friend early in the morning. So I went with another friend. And I think it was his birthday the, the day before, so it was nice for him to get a ticket, and the tickets were sold out, um, so it was nice we had one in advance. Um, but yeah, definitely lots of fun. It's nice to just be free, feel free, and like not really, um, not really worry about you know um, feeling uncomfortable or insecure. You know, like these like Grateful Dead shows are just so like free and open, and everyone's like free spirited and. You know, everyone's living some sort of lifestyle, you know, doing something. So uh, that's not even a talking point, you know, like, where do you live? Like, so um, I felt like it was an awesome show, awesome two shows to go to, you know, so I could just uh, get out of my head, you know, just have fun, talk to people. Um, and yeah, I really enjoyed it. I tried to get some footage, but I was just trying to enjoy the night. And yeah, I really can't complain. And I'm happy and grateful to have had a really uh, cool and safe night to wake up here in my van. <laughs> uh, actually feeling pretty good. I don't know, I don't really get too hungover. Like, I really just uh, drink some water, drink something with uh, some sugar, and really I'm good to go. Um, but yeah, I'm about to get out of bed. It's like 9.30 right now. Get started on some work. Just wanted to show you that uh, you can't live in your van and it doesn't have to be all you know, typical and and you don't have to dwell on negative emotions. You can still live a normal life, still, uh, you know, have fun with your friends. You know, I'm, I live like 30 minutes away from my best friend and she's completely cool with it. You know, she lives in a really nice house too, you know, and she accepts me with open arms and 
you know, I've really been feeling that uh, overall, to be honest. It's just like really important, you know, when you're going through something in life that's hard that you just have um, just support, you know, not a pity party, but like just true, honest, you know, organic support. Um, so I hope this was a cool little example. It's the Vine Zeal. Stay peaceful, stay positive, stay productive, stay progressive, and stay proactive. And I promise you, not only we have the most fun in your life, but you shall also, and always, be blessed. Divine Zeal, signing out, on my bed, in my van.